In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to load a game from a floppy disk on a Commodore PET 4032 using a 2031 single floppy drive. So the first thing you want to do is turn on the floppy drive and then turn on the PET. should say on the 4032, it'll say about 32 kilobytes free. Then you're gonna put in the disc, close the door, and you're gonna type load. And then there are two things you can do. You can view the directory by typing uh, uh, dollar sign in quotes, comma, D, or it's a comma eight, um, and then you press enter. And then what you'll do is you'll say ready, and you're gonna type list, and then it'll give you a list of the contents of that disc. So you can see I've got some games on this disc. We're going to load Space Invaders. The one that works on this disc is Invader. So I will type load Invader. End quote, comma, eight, and press enter. It'll find the game, load it into memory. And when it says ready, you're ready to run. So you can type run. And then you can play Space Invaders. That's how you load a game on Commodore Pet 4032. Now, if you have a tape and you want to load a tape, I'll show you some different directions for that. So we'll turn that off. So from the command prompt, if you want to load a tape, you'll plug in your tape, your cassette um, uh, player, your cassette interface. And you'll type uh, load, and then in quotes, the name of the game. So in this case, we were going to load invaders. Make sure you know that at least the first few letters of the game on the tape. And then you'll press play, and it'll say in, um, press play on tape one. Uh, and if you had a, a tape player connected to the, the cassette port in the back, you press play. It would say... Um, searching for a few seconds and I would say loading um, and then you'd probably need to wait a few minutes and then uh, once it was loaded it would say ready you could type run and that's it thanks for watching